In this video, we're going to explore how you can use the two fix method to round decimals. So for example, you have a number and your number have multiple decimals. But for, for if you have payments where you're using dollars and you have cents, so you only have two decimals. How can you control this? So let's start and explore how to do this. First of all, if you want to learn about ChartJS, check out my Udemy course in the description box. In there you can find a link directing you to the Chart.js course on Udemy, diving deep on everything about Chart.js. All right, so let's start and explore how we can use decimals in our JavaScript or in our variables. So for example, here we have a constant, and this constant is a sales price of a product. So we can say here, the customer is buying apples. And these apples, or whatever the price is here, we can put in here, oh, this is a, number so the number is 22.991231123 all right so we have here a lot of extra items or numbers after the the dot and this is fine however if you want to pay or you want to charge the customer of course in with financial numbers we always have two decimals and not more decimals so let's start and explore how to do this so with the, the uh, to fix option in, in JavaScript, you can start to do that. So how can we do this? Well, basically we copy the variable that we have or the constant and then we put it here and then we latch onto it the to fix command or the to fix method. And once we have done this, we can indicate here how many decimals do we want to have here. So we want to only have two decimals. So we can put in two here. And then if we will open up the console log and put it in the console log and save this, let's start and look. So once we refresh here and we open up the developer tab, you can see now the apples variable or the constant of apples has a price of 22.99 cents, which is correct because this is it. So if we so what happened if we say here's zero? If we do that and we save this, refresh, you can see now it rounds it up according to the nearest number. So it rounds the number and according to this, it will round it up because this is a nine. So what, what happened if we do one? Save this, refresh, and you can see now it rounds up as well because of 99 cents. However, you can see still the last uh, a decimal. So there's one digit after the dot so that's basically the way to do it and you can control as well so for example if you have instead of financials of dollars you have uh, oil prices and the oil prices are always based on three digits so we can say a tree once we refresh here you can see a three digits after the dot which is 991 that is correct it's 991 and this is basically how you can use the to fix option or method to control and round up or down depending on the value you have, round up or down the values to match it in the right format you prefer. So if you like videos like this, subscribe to my channel. And if you have any questions regarding this, post them in the comment section below.